is Valdor Adros here, Austin D from NS183. Today I'm going to perform my laboratory assessment in navigation, so which is discussing or on how to compute the magnet magnetic variation through bearing, true course, and the true heading. So let's go. So this is the problem. So the scenario is while steering 235 degrees PSC along the Raccoon Strait, the bluff point light borne starboard quarter beam at about 2000 hours determine the ship's true heading and the true bearing of the light observed. Use the given specimen of the, ob of the deviation table for determining the deviation to apply to magnetic variation for the locality is 2 degrees west. So this is the deviation table. So the first rule is to, ano po, is to find the 235 degrees PSC to find the deviation degrees. So, so the 235 degrees is between 225 and 240 degrees. So later we will we will get 225 and 240 and to solve the the division degrees. So this is number one solving for the magnetic division for heading 235 degrees PSC by linear interpolation so first just like what I said earlier we must to write the 225 degrees the compass heading 225 degrees and 240 degrees because between 225 and 240 degrees the middle is the 235 degrees just in the just like in the problem so the 225 degrees the deviation is 8 degrees east so the 235 degrees the missing is we must just mark an x so the 240 degrees has a deviation of 12 12 degrees east so first we must to subtract the 225 to 235 degrees and the answer is 10 and next, we must to subtract 225 to 240 degrees and the answer is 15. So, we must to subtract the 8 degrees east and x. So, the answer is we just mark an, an x. So, the 8 east subtract to the 12 east, the answer is 4. So, next is, we must to write down just like this. The compass, we must the 10 going to here. 15 going here, the X mark going here, and the 4 going here. So next, we must to use the cross multiplication. The cross multiplication just like this po. The 15 times X times X, yes. 15 times X equals 15X. 10 times 4 equals to 40. Just This is the outcome. So next is we must to transpose the 15x the x the x i the 15 to 40 so just like this po x equals to 40 over 15 so the answer is 2.67 so next is after we transpose we must to add the plus a because the deviation of 225 is 8 degrees and next is that the missing so we must to add the plus the 8 degrees is so the 2.67 plus 8 is the answer is 10.67 or 10.7 is so our compass heading 235 degrees and the deviation is the 10.7 is so next we must to solve for the heading the true heading so in solving the true heading we must to we must to use the candid man both twice it means that first compass heading next the d deviation magnetic bearing variation and the true heading so our compass heading is 235 235 degrees and our deviation is 10.5 Point seven east. So in finding the finding the magnetic bearing, we must to add add because in 
in the rule of east and west pag if if the name is east we must to add so the answer in this is 245.7 degrees so next in finding the ba with so next we must to subtract the variation and according and this variation came from the given we have the 2 west 2 degrees west so if this is west we must to use subtraction so 245.7 sub minus 2 degrees west the answer is 243.7 so that is the true heading so number 3 solve for the true bearing so in solving the true bearing we use this so the 235 degrees plus is the heading so we must to add the starboard quarter beam with the degrees of 135 degrees so ne so we must to add so the answer is 370 degrees so, then we must to to subtract in 360 degrees the total whole of the compass because we ma uh, to the according to the rule if we exceed to 180 degrees we must to add we must to the subtract 200 200 to 360 degrees and the answer is the 10, de 10 degrees and that is our true bearing so our next is finding the compass bearing so earlier we used the um, the candid man bow twice so ganun pa rin kukuhain pa rin, gagamitin pa rin po natin yun so first and we will use it upwards naman po pa upwards so our true bearing is 10 degrees yung sinuwag natin nga ganina so ma minus natin sa variation na natin ay ma plus natin sa variation natin na 2 degrees west and the answer will be the magnetic bearing so the answer is 10 plus 2 equals to 12 degrees so next ma minus naman natin yung sa deviation para makuha natin na natin yung compass bearing so kakaganina yung rule na if east ima minus natin, ipa plus natin, then west ima minus, baliktad naman ito dito. If west naman, ipa plus natin, tapos pag is ima minus naman natin. So 12 minus the 10.7 degrees is we use subtraction. So the answer for the compass bearing is 00. Point, 001.3. So that is the answer. So so next is this is the illustration of the outcome of my solution so the blue is the true bearing and the orange one lines ahead the vessel is the compass heading so thank you